Mark this day down. September 4th, 2012, Lamar University had a softball team hit the diamond for practice. It makes the first time that has happened for an LU softball squad since 1987. Six Sports' Andrew Chernoff has more. Go. Quicker, quicker, quicker. These steps today signaled the first Lamar softball practice of the year, and it was a historic one. The program is being restored after more than 25 years. Do you remember where you were 25 years ago? I wasn't born yet, so <laughs> I'm not really sure. <laughs> I wasn't born yet. <laughs> I, I was where these guys were here. It's been a long time coming for the Lady Cards. After completing summer workouts, the players enjoy just getting to go out onto the field. I thought it was really good. I thought we did good. We have a lot of room for improvement, and I'm really excited about the hitting. It's really exciting. It's been my dream, and it's just an honor that I've been given this privilege to be out here. Head coach Holly Bruder liked what she saw, too, even though it was only day one. I think for the first day, I think it's been great. I think everybody's given a great effort. They each know they have an individual plan, and we take that together as a team. The field inside Ford Park is something special also. That is where the team will practice and play their games. Coach Bruder spent a lot of her own time trying to improve the facility. So we, we had to top dress the outfield. We skinned the infield and put uh, dirt on it instead of turf. Painted the bleachers, hung a tent for our training facility. Uh, just kind of putting some lipstick on it. You know, behind me, you can see both uh, bullpens. We have four active bullpens out here. Most, most people have two. Sure, we can talk about what the team needs to improve on once the season gets closer, but today everyone was just glad softball is back at Lamar. You know, t today, uh, last night I couldn't sleep. I thought it was Christmas today. You know, this, this is what I love to do, and I, I get chills thinking about it. Today, today we're just kids. We're one of the kids. We're excited to be here. The team's first game is September 22nd against Texas Women's University. In Ford Park, Andrew Chernoff, KFDM 6 Sports.